Hey there, everyone. Thank you so much for clicking on this video and for choosing me to spend this time with. This is my channel, Once Upon a Nursery, and I am Tamara, head Fruit Loop, top dog, and your host as always. And welcome to Fun Fur Friday! Yay! I'm so glad to have you guys here with me today. Today is a special day. I will be doing something a little different with my Fun Fur Friday tag today. Not only are we celebrating the fun of fur babies and animals and all things animalistic, <laughs> but I am also doing a tag. We have, um, so my friend Leisha and I over at Binkies and Blankies Nursery, we have come up with a tag that we would like to do with all of you. It is a collaboration tag. Uh, it consists of six questions. So, uh, la, 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 la. <laughs> but before I get started with that, I want to introduce to you, not for the first time, <laughs> but this baby that I have with me today for Fun for Friday is Temperance Frost. And this little girl has a very special story. I actually did a six part series of stories with her to introduce her to my channel. She is very, very special. This is my number one dream baby, the Ayana by Gudrun Legler. And she is a replica, of course, but this was my dream baby and I was able to get her and I am so, so thankful for that. So if you'd like to go check out her story, uh, there, it is in my playlist, go to my playlist and you can just Hit that first video and it'll go through all of them. So, um, let me show you what she's wearing. Oh, let me, let me show you her babies. <laughs> this is her little bear. This is Binky Bear, Binks. And he is a little blue nose. I actually got this bear for Christmas when I was living in England one year. He was in my stocking. <laughs> and then we have her dragon, which is winter. And you will get to meet all three of these and the story that I wrote for her. But this is Temperance Frost with Binks in Winter. So I'm gonna move her lovies out of the way. I did change her off camera. So I wanna show you what she's wearing. She's got this bow in her hair that I made and look at this beautiful hair. Oh, I love her hair. It is so thick and it is so soft. She's so sweet. And then she's got this little dress that was sent to me in some happy mail. And I do appreciate the person that sent it to me. Look at that face. Oh, she is so sweet. All right. Well, that's what she's wearing. And she's got the little bloomers and everything. So that's what I had put on her the other day. Now let me show you what I'm putting on her today. I'm sure you can see it over here. But I have this pink flower headband to put in her hair and then I have this little pink skirt doo -doo -doo. isn't it pretty it's just pink and then I have this little onesie let's see what is this this is Granimals this is actually a 3t but she's kind of a big booty baby so I think this will fit her okay if not I have pins see they're right there <laughs> But uh, this is a little beginning, size three to six months. This was also sent in Happy Mail. Different Happy Mail, different person. But it's got llamas all over it for Fun Fur Friday because they are furry, are they not? <laughs> and then it's just got some little flowers here and there. But I love those little llamas. Aren't they so cute? So, so cute. So that's what I'm going to be putting on her today. But I wanted to get started with these tag collection, with, with these tag questions. So this tag is called, and it is by me and Leisha at Binkies and Blankies Nursery. Uh, go to her channel, hear her tag answers, subscribe to her, show her some love. Um, you can answer these questions down in the comments. You can do them on your YouTube channel. You can do them on your Instagram, or if you would like, Head on over to Leisha's channel and you can email your answers to Leisha if you don't have a YouTube or an Instagram or anything like that. Or if you don't want to put them in the comments. So yeah, you can head over to Leisha's channel and 
uh, click on her bio and she's got her email in her bio. You can email the answers to her as well. So this tag is called hashtag Dolly Collector's Choice. And Leisha and I came up with these questions together. Uh, she did two, I did two, and then we came up with one together. And then I actually thought of a bonus question. So, <laughs> but this is definitely a collaborated tag. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and get started. The first question, and these questions will be in my description. So if you would like to copy and paste, um, feel free to do that. I don't know why I took this off like this, but. All right, so first question, how did you come about collecting? Well, <laughs> um, back in, oh, I believe it was 2019, my grandma was diagnosed with dementia and I was just looking for some way to help her to, um, you know, to help with that. And I came across all this stuff about these reborn dolls and how they were helping with Alzheimer's dementia patients. And not only that, they're also helping with um, anxiety and depression, not necessarily in our seniors, but in all people. So this really intrigued me and I've always had a great love for dolls my whole life. And so I started looking into um, the dolls and I like, I looked at, uh, Ashton Drake and Paradise Galleries and just Walmart, Amazon. I was just looking all over just to see what I could see, find what I could find or whatever. So that's how I came into this hobby was, um, because of my grandma trying to help find, uh, something to help her. She did unfortunately pass away before I was able to get my first baby. So she didn't ever get to see any of my dolls or any of my collection. But I know she's looking down on me and she's loving my babies and loving my channel. So hi, Grandma. <laughs> so the second question is, how many babies do you have? <laughs> how many babies do I have? Um, uh, how many babies do I have? Okay. <laughs> I have... 44 babies, 44, I have 44 babies, <laughs> okay, so did you want a big collection or a small collection? Uh, when I first came into this hobby, I did think that I would have a small collection, I did, um, but as time went on, and I'm sure that most, like a lot of you that are new to this community or just maybe looking back can remember this as well but I I just remember I like I started getting like one and then I got another one and then I got another one and it just sort of dominoed and I was addicted and I could I was just like oh I want this one and now I want this one and now I want this one so I at first I can say that I did I was more interested in um, a small collection but as I started to get a couple more babies, I think I was at like five and I just like, I was just like, I want more. I just want more and more and more. And then I've been gifted some and bought some and just, yeah. So at first I did want a small collection and then I changed my mind and wanted a big one. And that is what I have. So would you ever sell a baby? No. <laughs> No, absolutely not. Um, part of the reason why I do this for myself is for mental health. And I'm connected to each one of these babies in such a way that it would hurt my heart if I ever had to give any of them up. So that is a no, no, no. I could never ever, ever get rid of one of my babies. And I'm sorry, I know you can't see her very well, but I'm trying to do her hair. Oh, my questions went off. My screen went off again. I have my oh, my questions on my phone. Um, and the last question, number five, is how long have you been collecting? And let's just start with that. How long have you been collecting? It's kind of a two-part question. 
Um, I have been collecting babies for about two years now. Um, and if you have a YouTube channel or an Instagram, how long did you collect before you started your channel? So I started collecting, I did start off with Instagram and that's all I was going to do is just have an Instagram. But, um, I, I started collecting on Instagram about six months after I purchased my first baby. So yeah, I was about six months along when I decided to start my Instagram. And then it was about three months after that or so that I decided to start my YouTube channel. So the last question is a bonus question. Boys versus girls, how many do you have? Well, I have, let's see, do I like this? I'm going to have to adjust her hair, I think. <laughs> All right, this is going to be, let me, let me answer this question and then I'm going to fix her hair. So, uh, boys versus girls, how many do you have? I have two boys and I have 42 girls. I am partial to girls. So <laughs> I, at first I really didn't want any boys in my collection, but I might be able to do this. Hang on. Let me see. Um, I didn't want any boys in my collection at first, but, um, as time went on, I fell in love with a boy doll, which is Denzel. And um, sweet, sweet Josie at Josie's Jungle Room, Dolly Mommy, gave him to me because <laughs> uh, I kept bugging her. <laughs> well, I would just say stuff like, you know, Denzel wants to come and let Auntie Tam Tam babysit him. And, you know, I think Denzel misses Auntie Tam Tam. You know, just a little joking around. And just one day she was just like, if you want Denzel, I'll send him to you. And I'm like, oh, my gosh. And I just... Oh, yes. Josie is a very special lady. She sure is. But, um, and then recently our Cheryl at Kylayla's Precious Ones, she sent me a tiny, tiny little silicone boy. So I am happy about him. I do love him. He is very sweet. I don't really want any more boys. To be honest with you, there is actually a boy in my cart on AliExpress. I probably won't ever get him because he is $70 because he is a 28 inch standing doll. So I probably won't ever get him. I do have some other babies that I want more than that, that are way less expensive that are in my cart on AliExpress. So yeah, there's only one more boy that I want, but yes. So I have 44 dolls, two boys and 42 girls. And it looks like temperance is done. So I hope you enjoyed the answers to the tag that Leisha and I came up with. And I encourage you to head to her channel and check her out and hear her tag answers. And as I said before, you can either do them on your channel if you have a YouTube. You can do them on your Instagram if you have an Instagram. You can put your answers down in the comments or you can head over to Leisha's channel and you can email your answers to Leisha. There we go. She's all dressed and ready for fun for Friday. Yay. Yay. <laughs> all right. But this was really, really fun. I really, really enjoyed doing this tag with Leisha. And I'm really glad that she came up with this idea. It was her idea. And I just love her and appreciate her. She has been such a great friend to me. And I love her channel. And I love all her sweet, sweet babies. And if you don't know who Leisha is, please, please go check her out. You will love her too. I guarantee it. <laughs> but that is it for us today, guys. So I've got Temperance all dressed and she's got her little buddies back hanging out with her again. Uh, don't forget to stay tuned to the end of the video if you would like to see the match items for Monday. 
I may or may not have a, some surprise videos coming up this week. We will have to see it for us today, guys. And I wanted to give an extra special big thank you and shout out to Leisha. I love you, girl. And I love doing this with you. This was so, so fun. Uh, I can't wait to see your video, sweetie. <laughs> But that is it for us today, guys. Please consider hitting that like and subscribe. If you haven't, hit that notification bell. If you want to be notified every time I upload a video, comments and sharing are always welcome. And if you'd like to participate in my tags over on Instagram, just tag me, use my tag, at me, and I will come and see the pictures of your babies dressed for my tags. All right, everybody, that's it. So from me and Temperance, we love you and we will see you tomorrow guys. Bye.